Hey guys, Summit Man here with another Let's Play of Pizza Tycoon. We're going to go in a restaurant. There's a few things I didn't show you yet, but like I said, as we continue on, I will show you more and more. Uh, did I finally get used to the room? It's not, but good for a snack. Well, what do you expect? It's only $10. Pizza around here is like 15 bucks a pie, because I live in the woods and whatever. Anyway... <laughs> If you want to see what your restaurant needs, uh, once in a while you'll see that you didn't sell the max amount of pizzas that were ordered because there was something wrong. You look in here. The top one here is furniture. See the red line? As long as this gray comes out past here, you're good. Now there are times that this red bar will actually go way out here and your furniture is here. Then you need furniture. Uh, then you have your ingredients, your chef your ovens and your waitress. Right now we're all good. We know that because we're not s not having any issues. We'll go back out. We'll end the day again. 53. Now we're starting to drop. I'm not sure why. I mean, we're still making money, but right now we're going to barely afford uh, we're going to have at least one more. Yeah, we're going to have one more salary. And that's not good. And the rent. Oh, there we go. Now we're back up. $400 profit a day. Not too shabby. And that's where you have to just keep an eye out. Especially when you're first starting out. When you're bigger, you can let it go up and down a little bit. If you see a restaurant going from 300 down to 10 you might want to do something. You know, I normally don't do advertising until I have five, six restaurants. Enough to swallow the cost of advertising without an issue. Uh, I normally don't get other restaurants until uh, I have, you know, this one, this building paid for. Because I don't own the building again, I pay rent. But I'm not going to bore you guys with trying to come up with $272,000. 58. We're going down a little bit. Let's check one more day and then we'll go get a loan for another store. We'll be risque. Something I don't do in real life. I don't risk money. And we're going down again. Uh, let's see if we stay the same or go up a little. <laughs> now I'm getting scared. Okay, we're staying the same. Let's check our profit loss ordeal. See if we're making you know, which we made money. We're over. We're. Hello. There we go. Go here. Here it says we lost money. But you paid the protection. You paid this. This could be sitting in stock. This is where you want to see it. See how it says profit of $282? You made a profit. Now, to go to get a loan, you go here. You can, this is where you buy and rent properties. Here's the banks, insurance companies. I don't normally do insurance. Authorities, which you have Mr. President, which is the mayor. We'll go in and say hi. He's going to tell us where he's too busy, but... Come on. Who are you? I don't have any time to waste with little people like you. Goodbye. Yeah, goodbye to you, too. Normally you can talk to him and stuff, but I don't bring enough money in. If you're the sh market share leader you can sit there and talk with them all day. Who are you? Get out of here at once. See? I can't even talk to him. But then, the others, this is the mob. This is where you buy weapons. You can buy bazookas, chemicals, bombs, the flamethrower. I don't remember which ones are which. I want to, you don't ever say I want to buy some weapons. You're going to jail. You're going to pay a huge fine interest in some brand new goods, that's if you want to sell him some goods. Do you have ice cream? The joke articles you can put in any time. Uh, if it comes up. It's these four. But we're not going to do that right now, only for the fact of I'm not wasting money. We're going to go to the banks. I will show you how to buy weapons, how to deal weapons and stuff like that. Uh, this is not like a where you can actually go in and shoot people. You just blow up their restaurants, basically. I always buy the chemicals because chemicals are easy to do. 
I need a loan. We can offer you $25,000. Now, that's another three grand a month we're paying out. Interest of 43%. No, I don't like that. I need a loan. Let me see if we can get a lower interest rate. No. You're a jerk. Let's see what the next guy offers. Get rich telethons. And this is all the, the names and the pictures are all jokes. You know, a guy with a bag over his head, guy in the back, peace sign. I, want, I need a loan. We can offer you the following loan agreement. 13000 for 27% interest for a period of 12 months. Yeah, I'll take that. Only because it's lower interest. And yeah, you may think it's high interest, but that's just the way this game is. Now, I don't want to put another restaurant right by that one. And I don't have the money to go right here. Right in here, because this is the most expensive area. Probably, basically, where I'm at now is one of the higher areas. Let's put one... Let's pick one right in here. And I see this one's... Uh, that's a that's a nice one, but that's ten thousand dollars a month. And that's ten thousand a month. Wow. That's for sale, though. That's for sale. That's for rent. I don't want to spend ten thousand right now because we're gonna only pay another ten thousand at the end of the month. So, what's this one? Not available. Not available. Why? Not available. Help. Can't you be nice? That's available. Oh, 20 by 20. Of course, when I'm not looking for a 20 by 20, I find one. Let's go... Oh, right there, what's that one? Ah, 20 by 20. Oh, oh that rent's not bad, though. Blue collar. Uh, 14,000. I better not. Okay, well, we don't have enough money right now. We want to save up some money and try and get this going. Maybe at the, f the first of the month. Ooh. Now, this is where he inspects us for an award. Not bad for start. I can award you a, f a star. You got your first star. And this is going to be slow. Concentrate on quality and your customers will reward you. Congratulations, your new status in the world is working. That's another thing I didn't show you. Your status. Now, since I paid the underworld to protect me, I jumped up in status pretty quick. All the work I've been doing on my restaurant, all the good stuff I've been doing, I'm up to worker. Now, that's not going to show you your stars, I'm sad to say, but you can get awards. But this is something you want to see. Arrival in Baltimore. I opened my first restaurant in within the first week. I opened, I was able to meet 100%. I took out my first loan, which was a day ago. First star awarded, and I got worker. If you watch this, you'll see some neat things, you know, things that you may not have noticed happened that they record for you. Let's go in here. Now, oh, I want to show you the star. See up here? See that? That's one star. Right there. You can get, like I said, I get three stars, no problem. You, the hardest part is getting the mayor there. You know, and I normally don't get him there. He just comes whenever he wants. Oh, 54. Really? I'm a one-star restaurant? You're going to give me a 54? Hi. Aggravating. See? That star helped us. 750. See? You make profit. What I want to do is finish this month off, and then we'll open our second restaurant. Only for the fact of we'll get charged rent right again. Again for the same restaurant, even though we just paid it, you know? That's the only lousy part about this. Now, as you see, this restaurant's climbing. So, opening a second restaurant might not be a bad idea. Another thing I want to show you is, is go in here and watch for your furniture. Eh, we might need some ovens soon. But, this is, now to figure out what furniture you have. Now it's, I, I just, from playing this game so much, I, really, you're going to play that game on me. I just know. But here you look, you have eight velvet blue and four mini tables. Now, where would you buy them? 
now, just because I know. You'd go through every one of them trying to figure it out. Whoop, not that one. Small and sunny. One. One, two. Now, like I said, this stuff isn't cheap, but it was well worth it. Now, you hit the upper arrow to find your table. You place your table. Then you place the chair, and you right-click to turn it, and you place another one. You probably could get four chairs per table, but I'm going to show you a neater trick down the road when we need the space. I mean, there are times that you need to pack these places where you can barely, you, nobody can really truly walk. So, and that's my waiter. Let me see. You won't see me again at that price. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. That just... Let me see what it costs me to make it. Maybe I am high. Do the info. Uh, maybe I can knock it down to 14. Come on. Load. There you go. Now, to change the price, you just click on it and type in the numbers. Oh. There we go. That price is okay, man. Okay, yeah, $10 a pie. See, I just think $10 is the perfect price. Mm. That's good. Now, another thing to check is the pizza charts. Yep, wrong button. This one. And the pizza charts. I'm not on there. But Soft Rock has four. Hmm. Go figure. This is the last day of the month. And this is going to hurt. I know. See, I bought the furniture. $1,700 of furniture. Yeah, it hurt us. But we made a thousand dollars profit this month now we're gonna lose that as soon as I hit this button ooh 95 see doesn't take long now that's the electric the more ovens you have the more electric you pay the more machine uh, games and stuff you have in there I never put them in now that's the repayment is one thousand dollars interest is two hundred ninety two dollars there's my rent that's the total we pay out and yes it shows we lost money but it's not going to be like that for long. Nope. You can wager money on them. You can win them, but I don't fight them. I don't like playing that game. That's for sale. Where was that one? Was it this one? No. Where were you? That one's not available. Let's see what this one is. Lake view, pond view, whatever you want to call it. New. No. Two rent. Sixteen by twelve. New. No. This, this is really ridiculous. That was not available. Not available. Now those will come available down the road. I don't want to build that close to a competitor. See this one. Two rent. Eleven thousand. We just cannot afford it. I should have taken a bigger loan. <laughs> we don't owe as much on the loan. Uh one thousand dollars less on the loan, so that's better. We're gonna have to play this game up and down a little bit because I don't have the money to open another restaurant. Okay, most beautiful restaurant in town. $2,000 to 13737 Okay. Now to transfer the money, you go here. Uh, I forget what the number was now. Was it 13737 or 12737 Oh, to transfer money. Two, one, two, three, and you hit the enter button. One, three, seven, three, seven. Yep, yep, oh, I got it right. And as you see, it took two grand out of my bank account. But 
at least you're in the competition. I'm not going to win because I'm not the market shareholder. And to figure out who owns the market share, click fly. We're in Baltimore here. Nobody. Okay, so anybody can win it. See? Now right there. My range just jumped up from 7 to 8, so I can get a little more customer base. So now tomorrow I might have more pizza sold. There's no... Oh, excuse me, there's no guarantee. Nope. But right there, 3900 and 1600 So we're making $2,300 in profit. Eh, you know what, maybe we'll invest in our store. Took out that loan, I'm not going to pay that interest for nothing. But I'm glad I did take out that loan, because I have $8, I would have only have $8 left. Not the button I wanted. This one. Now this is the flooring button. See that horrible freaking flooring? This is the flooring I use. Is it Fed Style Emporium? Is it? Is it? Yes. I just get this. Just a plain white. Makes it look a little better. And as you see, I mean, I didn't need to buy that furniture yet, but you never know when it's going to be the boom. Seventy-five. I.e., we're dying. This is not doing me any good here, people. <laughs> I wish I could beat people up to come in. That's okay, man. Yeah, I know. Whatever. So, we just gotta play it by ear. Go back out. Do it again. 71. Well, let me just do 7 day newspaper, or uh, flyers. Now, yes, you can do just the 100 flyers. Which, you know what? That's what we're gonna do. Now, see it's 7 days? Just hit this up out here, and I'll change the days. Do you really want to go 30 days? Because that's going to cost us $1,500. Let's go 20 days. Because that should be am the amount of profit we're making. Which, as it keeps falling down, we're going to lose more and more money. Come on. There you go. Hmm. That helped a little. Now another option is to put more pizzas on the menu. This is something I normally do. Go into the trends. Egg, olive, pearls, bacon, cockles, and blackberries. I normally make it that way, but tomatoes. There's no cheese on there. Just no, or just no oregano. No salami. No mushrooms. Okay. I can do something with eggs and olives, or let's do a cheese pizza with bacon. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, you don't make pizzas in the, the same way. There's no sauce to put on them. Just take tomatoes, cut them up. There are other recipes, I just don't remember them all from the competitions. But, we're just going to do this. We're going to line this in tomatoes. Oop, don't right click, unless you have the item in your hand. Or it takes the piece you just put on away. Now what was it? Eggs, olives, and bacon. And we'll just pick a cheese. Now the eggs are going to be here, I think. Yep. Now watch. The trend is mega in. See how it says trend over there? Mega in. This item is mega in. So this is going to bring the quality. Not, I mean, you're going to see the scoring is going to be good. But people are going to want to buy this pizza. Now we're going to have to go buy supplies because we don't have any of the cheeses. I don't think, or no, it's the fruits. So yeah, and that's where the olives are. No, they're not. They're over here. Olives, no. Olives over here. Olives, olives. There we go. And you always got to order the first time for your managers, or they're going to order the cheapest, you know, most inexpensive stuff, and it's not going to be top quality, and you're not going to get good ratings from the mayor and stuff like that. People aren't going to like the quality. And you're going to lose customers. 
So you always, I, I mean, for the little bit of an expense, yeah, it's probably about a dollar more a pizza. But for the little bit of an expense, it's well worth it. Let's go with bacon right here. And it's trend in. It's not mega in or anything like that, but it's trendy in. We'll put one right here. One right here. Now let's go with cheese. Oh, that's not cheese. Let's go with Parmesan. Parmesan or whatever it is. And you just click it twice in the blender there to make it this way. And just sprinkle it on the egg area. Now, I'm watch the score. It's going to be... No, it's not too bad. Oh, that's my first zero. Second zero. Okay, so it's not the best. Let's call it Trend Pizza. Or Trial Pizza. Trial Pizza. You've just created your own, yeah? Well, guess what? I, yeah, I'm not going to be taken serious. I know that. So let's go up here. Let's go to view it. Always view it first. Transfer. $10. Now, go in here. You're going to see that you're going to need to buy stuff. You can let it go, let the manager get it, but people are going to want that pizza. Let's go to meat. Yep, see? At least buy one of it. I always buy 10 of everything just because that's just the way I am. There we go. Thumbs up. Go here. And I need Parmigiano and egg. Parmigian, whatever. You guys know what I mean. <laughs> I'm horrible at pronouncing names. So, there we go. Now, let's go out and see if we got any more sales. No, we lost some sales. That didn't help. Let's see, come on. Mega pizza. Ooh. My waiter didn't order enough. Or my manager didn't order enough supply, I guess. And that happens. See? See? 101 pizzas. Now I wonder if we're on the sales charts yet. Am I? Am I? Pizza charts. No, I'm not. So, that kind of stinks, but... Okay, why is he not ordering the right stuff? Nope. That sucks. And you'll see that these people clo open and close. Over here it'll tell you open and closing restaurant. Uh, the person opened and closed the restaurant or whatever. I don't know why they open and close so many. It's got to cost some sort of money to do that. And I don't know. I just don't know how they do it. So let's try it again. 101. We're doing good. And that's where you want to be. I mean, you see we're up to 13, almost 14,000. Now they'll go down probably about 500. A little more than 500, 600. But now with the advertising and that good, that better pizza, people will recognize us and our numbers should stay pretty high. Should. I'm not guaranteeing they will. Okay, they're not staying high. <laughs> the thing is, it's very hard to make a pizza that everybody likes. There are ones in the game that, I mean, you can cheat in. I don't cheat pizzas in. Oh, no way. My stuff is not worth that. Yeah, I'm a big hero. So let me go clean up my place. See, they destroy your stuff. Oh, he didn't break my oven. Close restaurant. Yes. Throw that away. Throw it away. Throw it away. Throw it away. Nope, oh, I didn't want to open it. Oh, uh, close, yes. Okay. Throw it away. Now, the only way you can move furniture around, which I'm going to do that here, save us some money from replacing this stuff right now because we don't need it all. Throw that away. This stuff, throw that away. Move this here. Now, open the restaurant. Now, not all the seats are packed. Let me get three chairs and one table. Furniture shop. Small and sunny. 
one, two, three. Now, when you buy the furniture, as you saw earlier, it will close your restaurant for you. You don't want to be stuck close. Like, it, see, it says up there, 12. You don't want to be stuck. Really? You don't want to be stuck with the store closed, or you will not make any sales. Uh, but when you're placing furniture, it'll open the store right away. It'll show sales. If you close it yourself, you're in trouble. There. Let's see. 29. This sucks. This sucks bad. I'm glad I didn't pay him the 11,000. Wasn't that much in damage. 12 pizzas. What's going on here? Okay. I'm in trouble. Don't know what I did, but I'm in trouble. Let me go out and see what our advertising is. Six days left. We're gonna die. Yep, we're gonna die. <laughs> we're gonna run out of money. We were up at 100 pizzas a day. Now we're down to 12. And like I said, see this game... That's why I never ever want to open a second restaurant right away. I normally don't ever take a loan either. But... Maybe after the advertising is over. Sometimes the advertising impedes your growth. I don't know how it's calculated, but... Now I went from a range of 8 to 9, so that works a little bit. We'll wait until this advertising is over. I have enough money to survive the month. And then after that, we're in trouble. Which, maybe you guys... Maybe I'll stick around with this episode and show you how to crash. <laughs> how to run out of money. That, that oh, One more day. Oh, we went up one. I'll hold one pizza. That's... Mm, no way. We're gonna lose big. <laughs> it's what, $4,000 a month? Yeah, we're done. And we're crashing. We're crashing and burning. That's another thing, is if you don't pay them, you tend to lose business. I don't know why. I guess they think you're just cheap. So, this is going to stink. As you see, we are losing money at a rapid pace. No, I don't want to take part in your pizza competition because I'm losing money. And we're worried about it. Now, another thing I want to show you. Loss of $10,000. Because you have the loan. So that's what I owe on my loan yet. It's $10,000. Wow. Really? Wow, we still, we're still at a profit. Until one more month of rent and all the labor for that month comes in. And I think we're going to have to try advertising again. Because we're not getting anywhere. And that's why it always helps to have a wide variety of pizzas on your menu. You know, get everything built up first. Only 11 pizzas. And it's actually, my one pizza is the popular one. It's There's three others of the original that aren't. So right there we lost 1100 bucks. That hurts. And we're losing. We're going to crash and burn. Okay, this uh, this uh, video is going to go a little longer. What I will do is show you with my other one. Uh, <laughs> if this one crashes and burns, which it's going to. making uh, Selling six pizzas a day is not going to make it. Although the staff is enjoying the basic free paycheck for standing around doing nothing. See? You never know. It just it goes away. And I'm advertising I can't afford... TV. Can't afford the billboards. I'm doing what I can. Don't worry, guys. This will go quick. Yep, it's gonna go quick. Aye, vey. Aye. Ooh, we're up to eleven. Well, two hundred twenty-five dollars profit. Not gonna make the bills. <laughs> and you see here, 
our money. Yeah, we might want to start making some money because I, right there I have barely enough to cover wages, but it'll be gone because of the... Oh, I'm not advertising anymore. I only did it for seven days. Woohoo. Mm, nope, we're going to lose. Might take us a little longer to lose, but we're going to lose. I guarantee you by the end of May we will be gone. So this video is going to be a little boring until we get this going. Either it picks up a lot of pizzas or it crashes. But if I don't start selling more pizzas, by the end of May we're gone. Burp, barf, really? It's that bad? Really? You're going to be that ignorant. Yep. As soon as wages come by, we're gone. We got eighty-four dollars. Oh, I guess we're not gonna lose. Unless he spends a lot of money in food. Which I don't know why he would do that. Yeah, he's only spending $43 a day. Okay. Now I guarantee you. The next set of wages were gone. It's... It, we're gonna crash. <laughs> now some people say they never get customers in the restaurant. I got them in for a little bit. And now I just don't have high numbers. And we're gonna crash and burn. See, I should have never taken out that loan. Yep. Yeah, I'm going to show you, you guys my other video, or my other game. The one where I'm doing decent in it. Oh, wow, I went up to 14. You're not able to repay your debts. Hard luck, you are now on the streets and would be glad if anyone would offer you a job. Why not ask around among your former competitors? See? It's done. Try again. Yeah. But that'll be it for this episode, guys. I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. Uh, but until next time, we're going to go into this old game that's Invest. Okay?